Hello and welcome. We are back after a couple of days away and off and just doing other things. So we're going to have a look to see what is new today. Um, I managed to get some more XP through a couple of games uh, this morning. So we've finished the season. Um, got some good cards, got some good squads, got some more SPCs done. So yeah, today we're just going to have a look at what has dropped today on Sunday evening at 6 o'clock. All the normal content we'll just scan through. So there we go. I took the Crows over Gerard and I took the Pack over Puskas. Uh, so uh, let's see what else we got today. So daily plays completionist today will get a Javi Alonso loan, which is useless because most people will have already got him. And then the 85 plus times 3 tomorrow, as well as the 84 by 5. Um, we'll get this today, obviously. Daily play one, two, three. We get the the normal rewards there. Uh, one nation Brazil. We haven't even looked at path to glory. Yusuf Afana. We kind of started, kind of done a little bit, and then festival football. We are a couple of wins off the last lot of rewards. Seven eighty-seven pluses. Um, there is nothing to do in the seasonal section, which is not a surprise. And then milestones is just the normal things as we normally have. So, nothing there. Right. Um, do we have moments? We probably do. I think we do from last time that I just didn't look at last time. Yeah, we have some. How long have they been there for? I don't know. Oh, it says... Oh, maybe. We'll see. Um, yeah, we can do them. Get some more cards for those. Evolutions. What do we have evolution-wise? So, Legendary Status has been there for a while. Um, Festival Football Glow Up is there, as in Festival Football Glow Up 2. I'm about to sneeze. <laughs> Bless me. Um, Canarinho is there. The Elite Quartet one has expired. I didn't fancy doing that. So we've still got Stars and Stripes, Orange Onslaughts, Lucky Sevens and Euro Glory. I think we are going to pick Full Crew for that one because I don't have anybody better. I'll be honest, nobody else is going to get that. So he looks like a pretty good card. Put an engine on that. Near perfect utility, a balanced dribbling kind of thing. Pace goes up to 99.99 and the pass increases. So definitely an engine on that for that card. Obviously Germany out, not going to go any further upgrade wise. But it is what it is. So yeah, no evolutions today. No more gameplay stuff today. So it should just be an SBC and probably upgrades. Um, so yeah. Let's look. Normal global uh, limit packs. Uh, we've got nothing apart from the big old packs over here. And then that stuff there, which is fine. So, SPCs, it is as I always thought it was going to be. But let's have a look. So, okay, that's that. Um, Favourites. There is normal players. Who do we have? We still have Lizarazu. We still have Mascarano. Jota came out the last couple of days. Vegos came out yesterday, I think it was. Jordan Henderson came out yesterday. Turi has been there for a while. Lissandro Martinez is new at 94 rated with four playstyle pluses, all defensive. Three passing stars because normally he has CDM included as well. And two aerial play styles, despite the fact he is a shorter than average central defender, I would say. No physical ones. Obviously, rapid or quick step would have been nice, relentless, obviously. First touch is always useful. Um, but yeah, that's kind of what you would have expected from him card-wise. Um, yeah, it's very good pace. It's very good dribbling. It's pretty solid defending. 91 defending for a 94 rated card. Maybe a little low, but the defensive, uh, the physical side is fine. You could easily put an anchor on this. You're going to get pretty much perfect defending, really good physicals. And then you go to 99, 96 pace, which is pretty much perfect anyway. Uh, the passing is good. Yeah, everything is fine there. Only centre-back. Okay, no other positions on him. And four-star, five, uh, three-star, four-star. 5'10". Obviously, that kind of works for a central defender, but obviously you going to be you're going to be um, at a disadvantage in the air against strikers 
and other players who are of a taller stature. But yeah, Lissandro Martinez is new there today. Two segments, what is he going to cost? 85 87 is pretty cheap with no team of the week, team of the seasons either. For a Premier League Argentinian player, that's pretty good, which could increase further as Argentina go through the Copa America. Um, upgrade wise, we wait, that's that's a hero rather than an icon. Fantasy FC Galazzo or Greats of the Games Heroes 91 or higher. We're the team of the. Uh, the problem with that is you're going to get a lot of the lower rated ones, which either are not going to be good enough for your team, or B, you, you, they, there's a chance obviously you'll already have a higher rated version. Say, for example, Rizitsky, you'll get the mid. You'll get a lower Rizitsky that is, than is his maximum. So it's not just not going to be one that you... Oh, actually, there's a choice of three as well. That's a tricky one. 85, 86 is a decent price. But you've got a team of the week, team of the season in there as well, which is not great. Given the Martinez price as well. But the chances of actually getting one that is going to improve and fit into your team... You're going to see a lot of Viales. You're going to see a lot of Rosiskis. You're going to see a lot of Dudex. You're going to see a lot of that kind of card. And the ones that you want, you're going to see a lot, lot less of. That's the thing. You, people may get lucky, but overall, you're going to see a lot of the lower runs. Um, we've got all the normal, regular things. We've got 86 double. Is this the 85 rated squad? It is the 85 rated squad. We will do one of these straight off the bat. If I've got enough for eighty, I should. Yes, I do. So yeah, it's it's weird that the, I mean there are some good heroes. Don't get me wrong, but a the chance and b the f not getting a duplicate and c because where our teams are at this stage, are you actually going to want that? It's 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 a close call. It's a close call, but. Yeah, people. Some people will get lucky, like I always say, like like it's common sense. Some people are going to get lucky with a really good selection. Other people are not. That's just the way it works, unfortunately. Uh, we've got the normal daily silver, daily bronze, daily gold stuff, which we like, and we should have a challenge. We do. Are we just going to do a Spanish squad here? Yeah. Okay, so we do gold. Uh, we do Spain. We do Spanish league. And we do low to high. So we get near as near the 75 rated barrier as we can. There we go. Who is off chem? He's off chem. We don't have centre mids. Do we have any Spanish cams? We have a couple that are silver. Is that going to work for us? It should work. The, other, the others are high enough enough. Cool. So we've got the one, well, two rare now that we've got the silver in, and then nobody above 78, which is absolutely fine. For a prime gold player's pack, We'll have that as well, as well as the 86 double. Uh, do we have a new icon today? Figo, Kazias, Stoichkov, Pilo. No, we do not. So there we go. It is Path to Glory, SBC Martinez. It is the 86 double upgrade. It is the 91 plus hero player pick. And it is the normal daily play refreshes. There's nothing more playable. So, actually, wait a minute. At the start, it normally says what's cards have upgraded today I guess no cards are upgraded today because relevant live items are now upgraded so Van Dijk is now a 99 rated centre back so we've got a second 99 rated card after Verts. Uh Cruyff's upgraded Saka's upgraded so basically all the Saturday ones which obviously I didn't look at yesterday so that's pretty cool let's have a quick look at what English 
Spanish, uh, English, Dutch ones I've got at the moment. Have I got... Has Simmons had an upgrade? I'll be honest. Sometimes I cannot tell with a player. I can't remember what they were on before. Depay has, I think. I think he's gone from 96 to 97. That is a crazy card, and it's fun to play with. Uh, obviously, uh, English, special, not including loans. Actually, yes, including loans. Actually, not including loans. Watkins, I don't think he's had an upgrade. And then nobody else would, apart from McManaman. Or oh, maybe Shearer. 94? What was he? I can't remember. Was he 92 to start with? Has he had a double? No, he can't have had a double. And he hasn't got a 99 rated face stat either. And he hasn't been given a playstyle plus. So, okay. So we haven't got a whole load of interesting updates. Who have we got Danish, Dutch-wise? Seedorf has got that 99 passing. I think that's a new addition. Pretty sure that's a new addition. So he is lethal with the ball at his feet. Plus shot power and long shots 99, which means free kicks for him. Very much first choice there. And the good positions for him. Rijkaard, no 99 face stat, but has he gone from 98 to... 90, uh, sorry, 93 to 94? Has he got an additional playstyle plus? He might have. But, like I said, the problem, I can't remember what it was on before. And then we have... Reiners here, who has clearly made his tournament debut. I don't know if he's got two assists or goals. I don't think so. I think he should have got the five appearances, but I don't know what he came in on. That's the problem. I can't remember that bit. And then obviously there's nobody second page. So that's cool. So we do have some updates. Um, obviously the tournament is is now approaching into its last week. We have the semi-finals midweek, and then the end of the game. End of the tournament is. The uh, 14th, so a week today. So let's have a look at our prime gold players pack. And then obviously the 86 double is the chance we get for some a special card, a likely special card, but probably not. That's Millie, yeah, Millie Bright is the only bruiser at Chelsea, I think. So they join the club, only one duplicate, and it's only a Klaus, so we'll get rid of him. And then let's open the 86 double and we'll end it there. Yeah, we have an, a 94 Martinez, which is quite a nice little card. Um, at a pretty reasonable price as well. Um, he's a part of glory. Oh, we've got another one here. Dutch centre-back. Oh, it's going to be... Yeah, it's going to be a Van Dijk. Okay. A normal Van Dijk. And then we've got a special one behind. Who's the special one behind? Please be a nice one. Go on. Adam Klaus? No, Jimenez. He looked like... Oh, yeah, yeah, you can see it now. When he walked on, it looked different from the other angle. But he's four playstyle pluses and 94 rated. So that's pretty nice. We've got quite a good Uruguay team at the moment. We've got Nunes up front. Um, we've got Agate in the middle along with the other guy. And now we've got Jimenez and Araujo at the back. So that's a pretty good selection. Van Dijk will probably use to do the next upgrade. Actually, let's just do another upgrade. Why not? Why not? Um, yeah, and then we got the, the 91 here upgrade, which I probably am going to avoid. As well as the daily play objective, which we always get. So, uh, we need a Van Dyke. We need a Bright. And then we need... Um, no, 84s, basically. And then we need a couple of higher cards, but we'll go there in a minute. Yeah, so yeah, all your England part of glory cards will have had some sort of bonus. So you've got your Stones, you've got your Walker, you've got your Pickford, you've got your Saka. Um, potentially, I don't know, I don't know for certain, but I know Watkins has got cards, um, etc. So yeah, that that's there. We're above, are we? Can we take Bright out? Oh, so we're literally spot on with an 89 and 85 and then the rest 84s. It's pretty good. If we get another blue card, if we get another part of glory, I'll do another one and do all three straight off the bat. But I suspect we're going to get double gold here. 
Which is fine. Which is fine. But obviously, the special cards are why we play the game. They're the nice ones. So let's have a look and see what we get. Are we going to get another one? We are not. We are double golding to end the video. We are getting a Jan Oblak for certain. And then probably somebody higher. Please be higher. Be a Benzema. Or be an Mbappe. I still haven't had an Mbappe. I don't know who you are. You're Lewandowski. You looked not like Lewandowski walking on there. It's twice the angle has fooled me. There we go. La Liga. Both decent rated. So yeah, we'll do the last one later on. The video's gone on for too long. So yeah, today we've got um, yeah Martinez double upgrade and a Hero 91 plus player pick. Hero pick. So yeah, that's what we've got today. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you've had a good weekend. I hope you've been out and enjoyed the sun. I hope you've watched the football yesterday, enjoyed that, or the Grand Prix, or the tennis, or anything that you've really wanted to watch. And yeah, I will speak to you at this time tomorrow. Good luck with your picks, with your packs, and with your play. And I hope you enjoy your Sunday evening through to Monday. I'll speak to you then. Thank you for watching. Goodbye for now. Goodbye.